Welcome to Extra Throttle House. I'm Thomas. And I'm James. And we're running on two hours of sleep because we slept on a rooftop tent attached to a Toyota Land Cruiser. Yeah, we've been helping the guys mm. over at the Main Throttle House channel film their Land Cruiser video yep. because we've been using this as a crew vehicle. Yes, and uh, it has it has done crew vehicle duties quite well. And, and it certainly belongs here. So yeah. if you don't know what the Ranger Raptor is, first of all, the Ranger is Ford's mid-sized truck. And that's slightly exciting at the moment because every, it's, it's getting hot getting hot in the mid -time. It is getting pretty hot, yeah. So Toyota are chucking money at the Tacoma. We're trying yeah. the big Tacomas, the big engine Tacomas yeah. soon. And they're throwing, and Chevy have got the Colorado ZR2. Yeah. And then we got this yeah. guy here. This is the midsize. So honestly, I think that this is the new full-size truck. Because what, what are we just driving? I knew he was going to start I, with that. <laughs> I wasn't even going to tell you. talking about it. I didn't well, want to mention it. because I knew literally just drove by a Tundra. And you, you pointed at it, you said, that's a Tundra. It was like five generations ago, but it was way smaller than you this. You could put it in your pocket. It was so yeah. small. The trucks got way too big. All right, so the Raptor. Good now, size. 57,000 US dollars, yep. 77,000 Canadian. Yep. Think of it as the Ranger is Kirby from Super Smash and has swallowed a Bronco Raptor. <laughs> It gets the twin turbo V6. It gets mad suspension. It gets the you know Fox shocks, higher yeah. ground clearance, beefy. It's pretty beefy. It's beefy. It's got it doesn't have quite. Oh, how, you do horsepower. Oh, yes. They're going to want to know that. Go Four, ahead. 405 horsepower, Ooh. 430 pound feet of torque. So there's yes. a few horsepower off the Bronco Raptor, but it is a twin turbo V6. It's a twin turbo V6. Yeah. Yeah. It's not. It doesn't quite have the same level of stuff as the F-150 Raptor. Like the F-150 no. Raptor has like remote reservoir Fox suspension. This has. Fox suspension, just internal, but it does have like good stuff. It's got upper and lower aluminum control arms. Like it's, it's it looks very beefy. Yeah, it's still right? very much a Baja build. You still yes. get the new marker on the steering and wheel. And it's got some big old tires, which we've lowered the pressures on a little bit. You know we, what? These look big, but these are 33 inch tires. Yeah. Bronco Raptor gets 37 inch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which is just so insane. I think visually these fit the look of this truck. I, I actually love the look of this truck. Honestly, yeah, that's I think you're just obsessed with midsize, right? For now. some reason, I'm just obsessed with midsize trucks. I don't know what's happened. But yeah, think of, yeah, think of it as a discount Bronco Raptor yeah. in Ranger form, and it, actually, I think this is cheaper than the Trail Hunter TRD Pro Tacomas. Right, and it has a six. And it has a six in it. Yeah, yeah. So, shall we drive it? Yeah. Yeah, let's go for a little rip. In the desert. In the desert. All right. All right. Don't break it though, because we still got more throttle house videos. <laughs> okay, good point. To yeah. Do with it. All right, right off the bat, I don't know what this is, but it's a terrible design. I got, I got used to it. But like, you can't quickly put it in reverse or drive. And Harrison, who was driving this, he told me he said it felt dangerous because when you're on the dune, you, sometimes you don't make it up, and you got you, you need to go back now, yeah, like right now. And he, you're, you're like ri, 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 trying to get, 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 get you panicking, right? Yeah, anyway. that was that was an unnecessary change. Yes. Okay, where am I going here? How do we get here? We are just, we're just going free. This is the land of the free here. It's the land of the free. Lawlessness is, Lawlessness. The, is the name of the game. Um, so there's a lot of red. <laughs> there's a lot of, there's the a lot of red in here. Yeah. It's a raptor, raptor, yeah. raptor. Did you know there's a raptor? Yeah. Um, as I said, there's a lot going on. This re you know, reinforced chassis stuff. Like it's, yeah. they've made huge changes to this to be able to deal with exactly what we're looking at here. Yeah, exactly. I mean, this, this is more about, you know, travel high speed than it is about rock crawling, right? That it can do that, I'm sure. Yeah. Right. Like it has, it has stuff. We got too high. Have, have four we got low. the fun exhaust on? Um, well, I put it in. Put the, okay. Yeah, it's in Baja, Baja mode. That's it. That's the big yeah. mode. Right. Yeah. 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 I'm already in Baja mode, so I put the Baja exhaust on. All right. So where are we going? Okay. So we are in the desert, but we have lived with this. We've driven it on road. We've driven it on the highway. We drove it to Walmart. <laughs> And uh, I think it's, it's kind of a big thumbs up, isn't it? Right away, it's a big thumbs up, yeah. Because it makes that noise. Oh, the travel's so nice, isn't it? Yeah. So this is, this is literally what this car is made for. Truck, sorry. <laughs> but like the benefit of the Raptor stuff, we've it's said just... it before, is that the suspension suddenly becomes lovely all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like the ride on the road, I find to be, it's not as good as the F-150 Raptor, no. but it's very good. But it, you, you give up something. So like the towing capacity drops 2,000 pounds, which I know it doesn't sound like much, but that is the difference between Thomas being able to tow his race car and not. Yes. It's 5,500 yes. it pounds. It does have a trailer brake controller. At least, yeah. So that's yeah, 5,500 cool. pounds is the towing capacity on this. Yeah. So I'm going to put this in manual mode. Is there? Yeah, so we've got the 10 speed. 
<laughs> it's a cool plateau up here, sounds right? Sounds good. It does. That sounds fun. I like it. Again, not as raucous or as crazy as the tromboner in the uh, the tromboner, yeah. In the F one fifty. What kind of cliff is that? Not much. Okay, good. Yeah, we've you, never driven here before. You so. really can't tell in the dunes. You honestly can't. I love the travel. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> this is. It's kind of this like fun class. Uh, the money going to the midsize is kind of fun. Yes. You know, because as you said, midsize is the new full size. I love the size of this. Like, it's not intimidating to drive or park, right? We still got the power. We still got the noise. It's still a truck. We still we loaded this thing up for this trip, right? Yeah, yeah. And I don't know. Well, that's that's one of the other weird things about this class is that this is a big cab. You know, you've got four doors, four, you know, all the seats. Yep. And yet the the <laughs> the the, um, the bed is small. So it's like, it's not really a workman's truck anymore. This is more of a toy. And we, we've loaded stuff in, but it's not, yep. it's not generous with space. Yep. That's where an F-150 would crush it. No question, yeah. This, it, it's just, I really, really like these things. Not just this, but like, I like the, the F-150 Raptor and the Bronco Raptor as well. But are you gonna pretend you're not in love with the Tacoma Trail Hunter and TRD Pro, having, I, I, having not driven them? I absolutely am in love with them. They just look so good. I love the, like, I feel like I would miss this engine. You will 100% miss right? this Right? <laughs> yeah. But like, I'm really curious to give them a go. This engine, I think, would sell it for me. The, the thing is, is that, okay, how about this then? I haven't even driven the TRD yet, um, or the Trail Hunter, but I can tell TRD you- TRD Pro. TRD Pro. They're, the all TRD. They're all TRD these days. Yeah. I think that immediately if I was gonna, you know, bring this to the dunes here for the weekend to do some of what I'm doing right now, this yeah. is the one, probably. But, but, but no, if I was, who lives near sand dunes? The people that do that exist. But you don't. I definitely don't. So I would probably do the, 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 the Tacoma. trail hunter. Oh, you do a Tacoma over there? I would do a Tacoma trail hunter because I just I would want the reliability for camping trips and that sort of thing, right? Never having to worry about it. This is a Ford after all. Yeah, this will have worse fuel economy. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't quote me, I think it's like 14 or 15 right. combined miles per gallon. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh. <laughs> I think every time we've got in something that has the word Raptor on it, we've just had an absolute whale of a time. Absolutely, that's no question. And I, I know the price. I know the price is high in the Turn midsize, around. and I know there's, you know, there'll be someone in the comments saying you used to be able to get an F-150 Raptor for something that started with a five, but compared to Bronco Raptor, you, you're so much, so much cheaper here. You are, yeah. And it's still Ford built rough. You know, the interiors. The interior stuff doesn't feel super nice. No, it doesn't, but I, you know what? You know what's funny is that ever since I put this in Baja mode and started driving on the dunes, I haven't looked once, which means you don't care. Yeah, because you're Baja. Right? It is the coolest thing. I, <laughs> I seriously love it so much. But like, have you felt uncomfortable once? No. I'm going 55, 60, 80 miles an hour over sand. There's almost something therapeutic. About Isn't it? It's just great, yeah, yeah, honestly. It's like a shoulder massage. <laughs> Like I'm gently holding my hand. On yeah, the I know. Here, like, you, you, we're just, yeah. oh, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's Bob, no, you Bob. You do Bob, yeah. You Bob. I, I really, really like, I really like this truck, no question. I will say that on the highway, um, it doesn't feel as quick as you'd think it would. It should. No, yeah, I think it does like a five and a half-ish seconds to 60, which yeah. is very quick. It is quick, but like when you're already at speed, I don't know if it's wind resistance or whatever it is, but it doesn't like get up and go quite to the degree you feel like it should for having a twin turbo V6. I agree. Right? Yeah, I agree. But I haven't noticed that out here when I'm doing this. And like when you're just putting around town, I enjoy the travel, the ride. Like, uh, I, what did I say to you recently? I said, I think a Bronco Raptor is the perfect LA car. This is all the big culverts. Big and like dips. The, the yeah. big like the drainage things. And you don't have to worry about it with these things. It's got travel, big tires, who cares? But for the discount, I almost think I'd take this over. This, I'm starting to think this, this that way. This has better road manners than the Bronco Raptor. It does. It's, it's not, quieter it's not, on the highway. Yeah, it's, well, it's yep. got, the tires aren't as crazy. Yeah. It's, 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 it's calmer until you get here and then it does the same stuff. And the, but the F-150 Raptor does all of this stuff better than those two. Yes, it does. No question. And it has a better ride. Yeah. It's also a lot more money. A lot more money. And I don't like the size, it's too big. But as I said, as of this moment, as of filming, we have not tried the Colorado ZR2 or yes. ZR2 Bison. Yep. And we haven't tried the Tacoma TRD Pro or Trail Hunter. Correct. Watch this space. <laughs> we we can't officially yeah. give you a conclusion, but yeah, I think this is a great vehicle. Although so. it's possible, 
our Tacoma video will come out before this. Oh, so maybe you'll already know. Well, then that's boring, because now that's you know boring. what no, what's, what's the point of this thing? You shouldn't have watched this video.